Your sub ran out. That's okay. Yep. It, like, I can't do it anymore. I don't know what it is. How do I, I... I don't think I've ever just completely lost the strategy before. This is my first time ever. I'm out of there. I don't know what I did to have my time be so bad. Maybe it was the Hammer Brothers. Nice guesses, guys. Didn't even know that I'd reset. Otherwise known as the free set. Yeah, dude, I like that. The free set. Uh, oh, there is one other thing, one other piece of information about the Warpless Tournament that I can give you guys, and that I will not be in it. Yeah, win my own cash prize? I don't think so. Yeah, I saw the vine. I can't really watch it right now. If you post it in Discord, I can watch it later. So anyone in chat right now who's thinking, Oh, I, sh I want to play Mario 3, you should start right now so you can join the tournament. Okay, you all have to pray this entire level. No way you can join the tournament. You'll be surprised what you could accomplish in a couple months if you try really hard. Nope, it's gonna be vanilla. It's gonna be vanilla Mario 3 Warpless Tournament. You guys didn't pray enough. Thanks. Why do I even ask? <laughs> oh, thank God. See? I do it myself. Pray to the RNG gods. <laughs> In my own Mario 3 tournament. <laughs> That's so jank to like enter your own tournament with a cash prize. Let me just go ahead and join. Do I have to pay taxes on my own winnings? Uh, don't be trying to farm for subscriptions there, Mr. Gordon. What if I join just for fun? I don't know. I mean, if, if a lot of people don't join, then I might have to for numbers. So, I'm trying to, I'm trying to let the word get spread. Papa Bowser Gordon asked for you. 
He asked you for a subscription and a whisper. He asked you if you he could. Wait. So wait, Papa Bowser Gordon asked you in a whisper if you could give him a gift sub. Gordon! Come on, dude. My cha- I ain't gonna have no freeloading bums in my channel, okay? I'm not gonna ban you, but you gotta cut that out. You can't be asking people, alright? <laughs> I'm a freeloading bum, but I keep it to myself. Yo, Reex! With the win! Ugh, am I gonna have to turn this minigame off? What is- why is everyone winning all the time now? Can you guys stop it, please? And by freeloading, I mean Twitch Prime. Woo! And by freeloading, <laughs> um, I mean Twitch Prime. No. for gift subs are usually the same people who don't continue the gift sub they get well makes sense if they could afford it they probably would i sorry i'm 13 i didn't try to sound that way it's all good people make mistakes just don't just just remember not just in my channel, in any channel on Twitch, don't ever ask other people for gift subs, okay? Just keep that in mind. I'm not gonna ban you, I'm sure it's just... You just wanna get in on my emotes and have fun. Uh, why is what such a problem, Maru? What, the 2-1? Two 2-1 one? Two one vine? Classified as drama. I saw. I I figured as I figured the problem that was that was brought to my attention was solved. I think within like 30 seconds. I don't think there's really any drama. But um, if you're wondering why people asking other people for gift subs is a problem, because it's no different than personally ask people for money. Right, like, so my position as a Twitch streamer, as a content creator, it's, what, what is it insinuated? I don't know. It's just the way things go on Twitch where the content creator, you know what I mean? But with chat and individuals, it makes the place somewhat uh, more uncomfortable, I guess. Like other people, people get uncomfortable. He did move up, and he moved backwards. Give you five dollars so I can sub to you. Yeah, it's really good RNG, but I bet you a thousand bucks, I'm gonna get the yellow bro. Followed by runaway bro. And then, something else. It's okay. Oh, the game knows, man. Wait, did I get hammer second? Or first? 
Sun level does kind of feel a little random. so weird with their level decisions in this game because one like not every world has a weird gimmicky level but some do like why does world 2 have a weird tile sand level and a weird pyramid tile but like world 3 doesn't have any special level tiles world 4 doesn't have any special level tiles world 6 doesn't world 5 does with the twisty castle right and world 7 with the piranha plants but they're, they're not like Right? It's so weird. World 1 doesn't have anything interesting with it, or World 3. But, like, each world has... Each world has its, like, own weird little thing. But they're little things in different ways, right? So, like, World 2's is desert, but, like, a interesting desert tiles. Levels that you can enter. World 3, you have the bridges that periodically open and close, combined with the boat. And you can swim on the water. World 4, everything's giant. And uh, in World 4, 6, you can actually go in a doorway and make everything small again. I don't know if any of you guys remember that, but in 4, 6, if you go through the doorway, all the big stuff goes small again. It's actually two levels inside of one. It's not one level with... It's not one level that actually changes things from big to small. It's two levels. So it's pretty crazy. Um... World 5's got nothing, and you just go into the clouds, man. There's nothing special about World 5. Ah, oh, I missed my Empress. Focus. Yeah, well, the coin ship doesn't appear in worlds that don't have legitimate Hammer Brothers. So, World 2, it's Boomerang Bros. Those aren't Hammer Brothers. And in World 4, they're, they're Giant Bros. They're different Hammer Brother levels as well. I'm pretty sure coin ships are tied specifically to the Hammer Brother layout, which is the normal one in World 1 with the one row, and then the one in World 3, 6, and 5 with two rows. They're like the same thing. The red spinning platforms are in, are in this world as well. There's one in 3-3 three, three and 3-6. Three, Get 69 minutes yet break. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. We gotta get the 69. The 69 pog. Yo, I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing? Today's the day. Let's do it. Nothing like a good old Sunday, man. Just started my stream. Having a good time. Right on, 66. I have to remember that I have 66 coins. Uh-oh. No misclick hype. Uh, I usually stream until my thumbs kind of hurt. Sometimes that takes like four and a half hours. Sometimes I can go for about six hours. This is very straining on the fingers.
Oh, she's just kidding. That was so scary. Yo, Gino, what's going on? I almost got a coin ship there. Got him. Fo Remember Fox McCloud eating medium french fries? Yo, Mr. Cheese, that's right, man. I only take Saturdays off. I know some of you are still like, where's Mitch? Why isn't he streaming? And then you're like, oh yeah, it's Saturday. He doesn't stream on Saturdays. Yo, I got the worst Hammer Brother movements in this world. By far the worst. The spade game is giving you a thumbs up. <laughs> right, huh? Yo, take it easy, man. I'll message you if you win. I, I can almost guarantee if E. Foley comes back, he's probably going to snipe it, so we'll see. But, yeah, I'll let you know. If you don't come back tonight, then, yeah, I'll probably send you a message on Discord. Good luck on your race. <laughs> right? Don't worry, there's tons, tons more of Kaylee Furlers. Yeah, good luck, man. Oh, you guys have seen the basket of pearlers? There you go. <laughs> there you go. Yo, Kanuntend. Hello. Welcome back for two months. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'll be celebrating Thanksgiving. Even though I'm Canadian, I celebrate both because I live in America. They moved me here from Canada. Because they think I'm slow, eh? <laughs> as soon as Neo leaves, E. Foley shows up. What do we have here? <laughs> Hello, Super Nintendo Chalmers. I'm surprised The Simpsons didn't get sued by Nintendo for simply just saying Nintendo. That sounds like something Nintendo might do. Love The Simpsons. I love The Simpsons and I love Nintendo. So it works. 
Super Nintendo Chalmers all the way. Have you guys gone? Have you guys seen on the internet these the um, Super Nintendo that's painted and has Superintendent Chalmers on the Nintendo? So it's actually Super Nintendo Chalmers. Have you guys seen it? It's hilarious. It's a good looking Nintendo. Learned it. Dude, I've been watching a lot of Simpsons in my downtime. Um, so one of my so far one of my favorite lines in the past like eight seasons that I've watched. I have a bunch of favorite lines in the past eight seasons that I've been watching. But Homer's at work and he's explaining the movie Speed. And he's like, if the speed goes over a certain limit, the bus explodes. And he's trying to think of the name of the movie. <laughs> he, yeah, he says speed like 10 times in the explanation. And he's like, I think it was called the bus that could slow down <laughs> like i couldn't i could because he like he like goes off like it's so awesome and i couldn't stop laughing then i think it's called the bus that couldn't slow down <laughs> so stupid. Oh, that's so funny man that's so funny i can't there's some things in The Simpsons that just makes me laugh so freaking hard. The bus that couldn't slow down. Yeah, Simpsons season one day. Season eight is 1997. Simpsons still stayed good by the time they hit 2000. The next three seasons are still good. Yeah, Grandpa Sister, Grandpa Simpsons good, but like not that good. You you want to know what I'm noticing as an adult is that uh, Marge is actually a pretty good character. When you're a kid, Marge like sucks, right? But as an adult, Marge is actually pretty good, man. Wow, it actually cuts off the show, really? When Homer loses Maggie, Barney, he's like, I think I got her! And he's like pulling up piping from under the stairs. <laughs> he's like ripping so hard. <laughs> oh, really? Yo, TG, what's going on? Yeah, you definitely have to revisit from season 1 to 8, for sure. They got some classic shit, man. It's so good. Little girl loves her brain. 
Tell us what you think. No, yours is just an extension cord tied up. Dude, he's ragging on your cord. I noticed in some of the newer seasons, Mr. Burns sounds different. And... I think a couple other characters sound different, don't they? What? How did I not get peace speed there? So I'll go out for some frosty chocolate milkshakes. Her name's Krabappel. Oh, I've been calling her Crandall. <laughs> oh, I've been making an idiot of myself. Lisa, join the family. Wesley, get Mama's Prime Bar. Easy does it now. <laughs> Mono Dog. Mm, free goo. I do not have Disney Plus. I act this weekend, and I think every all of you guys should do it if you guys don't do it. But this weekend, I sat down with Kaylee and I looked at all all of my subscriptions and all of my monthly payments to a whole bunch of all these like media media things, and I don't need Disney Plus. Don't need it at all. Having Netflix and like Prime Video is just enough. Why? Why did it do that jump? So fucking stupid. I have no idea why it did that jump. <laughs> He's like, during during that montage of the buildings falling over, after one fell over, Homer's like, I didn't think it was gonna fall down. It's like Whee! that's what the show's. Yo, flips, man, welcome Money back for nine can be months. Exchanged for goods and services. Yes, that's right. You might remember me from such films as Mommy, what's wrong with that man's face? Gee, I'm getting a nice run. Yo, thank you. Blown away, George. Blown away. I'm sure this has been said already, but it needs to be said by a mod. 
crotch cam crater. <laughs> That's right. Now you guys can see what I do with my controller. Hey, do you know what I learned after rewatching The Simpsons? Is that Morpheus plays the fox. In that episode where Homer eats the chili pepper. Find your soulmate, Homer. Find your soulmate. And then the fox is just like chewing on his... Or is a coyote, sorry, not a fox. And he's just like chewing on his leg. Yep, good old Lawrence. Good old Lawrence. The Simpsons is so much better as an adult, but it's still awesome as a kid. I watched Simpsons growing up my entire life. When I was a kid, I didn't understand the joke about Bart getting the Hawaiian shirt out of the closet. Obviously not until I was older, right? I didn't understand the whole... I didn't- I obviously didn't get that. How would I even know that as a kid? So Simpsons is awesome like that. Not that it's got a gay joke, but the fact that their jokes go so far. And no matter how old you are, you're still gonna see and find some new things in Simpsons that make it such a good show. Johnny Cash voiced the coyote, are you sure? Definitely sounds like Lawrence. Who doesn't? Definitely sounds like Morpheus. I never read the Simpsons comics. I think it was called the bus that couldn't slow down. I'm not say I okay I, like I get it it's Johnny Cash I'm just saying it sounds like Morpheus I will play it on YouTube right now we can all listen to it it's not they have pretty similar voices you can easily mistake the voice for Mr. Lawrence the comics the Simpsons is on TV still right I'm pretty sure it is
Yeah. Oh, I could go for a tab right now. No time! Oh. All this computer programming is making me tired. I guess I could go for a tab right now. Didn't, didn't uh, Fox buy the rights to The Simpsons until 2079 or something? 2079 or something like that? Fox will ride that train for a long time. Fox will have to go out of business eventually, right? Unless Fox gets an online streaming service, which they probably should, right? Eventually. Do I do the finger exercises? Sure, all the time. Oh, they're owned by Disney. Cool. Right on. So they're safe. Yeah. Well, now with yeah with the whole Disney thing. So I mean, I'm pretty. I was pretty right with the whole thing. Any. I feel like any TV station that wants to survive in the next 50 years has to create online streaming services, a YouTube channel. You know what I mean? Copy Netflix. Copy Prime. But Prime copied like five other ones. When Netflix came around, it was like Netflix and like, what, a couple others, maybe? When Netflix started up, was there any other online streaming video services? I can't remember. I, I, I think there was at least one or two. Probably, maybe. They just weren't very well known. Hulu was out at that time as well. Are you sure? YouTube started in 2005, didn't it? As well as Blockbuster, right on, cool. Lots of lots of cool things to still learn about that stuff. YouTube is like 2004, 2005. I jumped on Netflix pretty quick. I kind of miss going to Blockbuster 2. It made adventures of our Fridays after school and stuff. Blockbuster could have bought Netflix, dude. I mean, even if they did buy it, they probably would have fucked it up somehow, right? They would have messed it up somehow. Best blockbuster snack? I was I like chocolate covered raisins. They taste good and they massage your gums. Don't you me? We also had Jumbo Video <clears throat> in Canada, right? We never went there, though. We were close to a blockbuster. But Jumbo Video was definitely a thing. It had a big elephant on it. Oh, I know the Jumbo Video.
Shadows of the Empire, 64. I remember I marked my Paper Mario cartridge. Because I was on Bowser, but I didn't beat it by the time- Oh man, I hated that with Blockbuster, dude. I hated that with Blockbuster. Having to return that shit, you have three days, right? And my parents never went for the seven-day rentals, because they were... Three days was the max my family ever rented anything. Please be kind and rewind. Man, I grew up in a house that didn't have movie magazines or anything like that, so... Knowing what was gonna happen in any movies, or like, knowing what to rent or what to buy, was solely based on the back of the book. Or sorry, the back of the movie case. And that was a pretty risky thing. Unless you saw commercials on TV for it, or your friends were like, yeah, no, that shit's good. Like, you... you went blind. The only way to know is if you had a computer at the time, which I don't even know if that would really have helped you, or you had like movie magazines and stuff like that, right? You could copy the VHSs. Now, you weren't supposed to do that, okay? You weren't supposed to do that. I won't tell anyone, but... I won't snitch. Snitches are bitches that get stitches. That's all I have to say. Snitches are bitches that deserve stitches. Everyone knew that Blockbuster had that rewinder that went like a thousand miles per hour. All they had to do was have one guy take the box out and be the rewinder. It would take him 10 minutes to rewind like 50 movies. Who here had a slow ass VCR that. Ugh. Dude, my VCR took forever to rewind. You could like watch the seconds. It like took five minutes to rewind it. it sucked. Apparently, there's one blockbuster that still exists, right? Yeah, blockbuster's still a company, I mean, if it exists. Unless it's a privately owned. Unless one person just, like, owns it. Owned privately. So, it's some dude who just has a family... A ma, a ma and pop video store... That's Blockbuster Incognito, right? Whee! <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna fly to Alaska. I'm gonna fly to Alaska and live the live the renter's dream of renting of finally renting a movie from Blockbuster once again. I know they say please rewind when you bring it back or you know please don't scratch the DVD or Blu-ray. He doesn't know that I'm not coming back. I'm flying there for one day, so I'll send it back by mail. The perfect crime. Now, the only thing that can incriminate me is this video proving that I committed the crime. I trust all of you guys. There you 
there you go. That's just intent. Exactly. I haven't committed anything. Get your hands off me. It's in Oregon, not Alaska. That's an easier flight. That's a better place to go, too. <laughs> Dude, I just, I can't fathom it. It just doesn't work. It doesn't, I can't, man. I can't do it anymore. Like, I can't. God, I'm so annoyed by that, man. It's the only thing that just doesn't work anymore at all. Out of everything that I do in this game, that just, it doesn't work. doesn't work. I practiced it at the beginning of my stream for 10 minutes. It doesn't work. Nah, I don't know. It, it just doesn't work. I've developed some kind of inconsistency, which is so, I hate that so much. I just subcon I just subconsciously attached myself to a strategy that doesn't work. And that's like what I do now. It's so annoying. That was a good World 6, too. That was a really good World 6. I would have saved time! I would have saved time, dude. I would have saved time. to deny that this is warpless with that with the auto scrollers I have to talk is making me nostalgic for nice. the time I worked there nice I never worked at a blockbuster thanks for the 420 though
take damage with Fire Flower so that I can keep peace speed. And I don't need Fire Flower because I use a P-Wing after this level. So it's a win-win. There's only one one left, that's right. There's always something in this level. You guys remember when that one fish? was perfectly positioned to kill me at the end. Do you guys remember that at the pipe? What a ripoff, man. What a ripoff. Keep on lagging for me, please. I don't need the time save because this runs really good. I'm ready to get world record now. <laughs> Come on, guys. Don't screw me. Come on now. Go, 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 go! Look at this guy. Move! Move your ass! Thank you. <laughs> Dude, they're just ready to screw you over so hard, man. They're just absolutely ready. That's fucking great, man. What the fuck, man? Mm. Wow, 
loud noises. Yo, Twitch Prime, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Crotch intensifies. God fucking damn it! That ruined everything, dude. That ruined everything. On God damn it, dude. That ruined it all, man. Yeah, it ruined it all, dude. It's over. I was hoping to get a sub 111 this run. Why did I fall off that pipe, man? Fucking ruined it all, dude. Now I can't fire kill. Damn it. I tried to go for the pause strats, but it didn't work. I tried, guys, I tried.